Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So six months ago, I posted that Microsoft is working on a new color picker for the Edge web browser for desktop. And basically, uh, there's a new color picker on the appearance page that um, lets you create themes with custom colors. And this, over the last couple of months, has been on a controlled rollout. And not everyone, including myself, was seeing it in all my Edge Canary browsers on my different devices. But uh, just to let you know now that um, the color picker is now available to all Edge Canary users. So it's no longer on a controlled rollout, which is a good indication now because this feature has become available to all so-called insiders testing the feature uh, in the early preview version which is currently sitting on Edge Canary 126. That's a good indication now that Microsoft um, is thinking of pushing this now down to dev, beta, and then officially out in an upcoming release to the stable version. Now, just a quick recap as to what the feature does and what it's all about. Um, obviously, on your appearance page, under themes, you'll see a new color picker um, option. You click on that, and here you'll see uh, you obviously can change the uh, the different color and then you can fine tune that hue or that color to kind of streamline that to your own personal choice and preference. And as you move that around, obviously you see that change uh, in the little thumbnail. And then once you've selected your different color, you obviously can change that slider to any given color. You can fine tune it as mentioned. You click apply and there we go. And another thing is also, as I've posted in a previous video, and by the way, I'll leave the previous video I did post on this uh, in the end screen. You can also cancel um, if you don't want to apply that change. And yeah, you see your recent color. So I've just applied um, this color. Let's choose another one so we can just see the recent menu. There we go. And if we come back, you get the idea. So yeah, you've also got your recent little thumbnails here for your recent uh, colors that you have applied using the color picker, which I actually think is a nice kind of history timeline. So it also gives you a quick option just to go back to that and apply a, a previous color. So nonetheless, the fact now that this is now rolling out by default to all Canary users is a good indication now that this is going to uh, further, Microsoft is going to further testing on this now, do further testing on the feature, roll it down through dev uh, beta and then out to a stable update in the future but obviously i'll keep my eye on this and if i get any more info i'll keep you guys in the loop so thanks for watching and i'll see you in the next one